Now, what a day it is out there today, Shane. Uh, nice drive up from my little neck of the woods, which is uh, in Hereford Road. Nice to be here, and uh, nice to be here with uh, Graham, uh, Mike, Shane, and uh, Shirley, of course. So, um, Shirley, uh, how was your session today? Excellent, thank you. Yeah. We had Mike playing the drums, they did a great job. Then um, Graham was working on some bass lines, which sounded great too. Awesome, and what sort of bass, uh, what's your, what's your, what's your flavour for bass there, Graham? Uh, I've written a bass line, but I'm not good enough to play it yet. Yeah, it's quite often the way, isn't it? You know, you, you come up with an idea and then you think, gosh, I can't quite put that one down yet, but um, never mind, I guess that's a little bit what recording's like. And Shirley, uh, oh, sorry, you're, you're the main person here today, aren't you? Yeah. This, that's what we're coming to uh, talk about, and it's uh, Shirley Ryder in Circles. Hello, Shirley. Hi, how are you? I'm awesome. Shirley, um, just tell us a little bit about yourself as a, as a songwriter and vocalist. You know, where, where, where'd you come from and... And, uh, I mean, I've just seen you on YouTube and, uh, you know. Well, um, I've been writing songs. I wrote my first song when I was 12 years old. But I haven't really seriously got into it until I was in my 20s. I really started and went into some songwriting competitions. Um, and just recently I've taken it up again. But over the whole time of my life I've carried on writing. I just haven't done much with the actual songs. Until really one day Shane rang me up and said, Oh, do I want to be in a project right. that he was running? Okay. And so we sort of got together a seven piece band and we were doing our own recording with that. And then about a year later or a year and a half later, I got um, Graham and a couple of other guys together and we did a gig of originals, of my originals, out at Tarico Hall. Oh, okay. And it kind of just all came about from there. Was Steve Wren involved in that one? Yes, he was, yeah. Oh, was that a, was that a July one or something? I, I never got May. to that. May. May, okay, great. Yeah, the, I mean, that's a great place to have any uh, kind of original music up to Town Rico because it is an original place itself, isn't it? If you <laughs> like fruit and veggies. But anyway, back to Shirley and Circles. Um, what, so so the, how many how many hits has YouTube had as of today? I mean, this is Friday okay. Friday afternoon, and uh, what's the time? It must be around 3 o'clock. Well, when I looked this morning, I think it was 14.03. 1403, that's 1403 hits on YouTube. And so they can purchase your um, music on, on what, what to, where is it, SoundCloud or is it uh, Reverb Nation or Reverb something? Reverb Nation, or? yeah. Okay, and how, how, you know, for somebody like, you know, we've got some older listeners listening today and, um, you know, I've just played a little clip before this mm. of Circles and, uh, and, uh, and, and a few people phoned in and said, hey, that sounds a little bit different. And uh, they said, well, is this in the record shops or something? Because I know some of my grandkids really love this sort of music and, and I mean, I like it too. So where can I buy a copy? Well, around about Christmas time, I'm anticipating it will be available on iTunes, Amazon and also be able to download it as a ringtone. Fantastic. So having an EP for Christmas, that's got to mean some money in the bank. Hopefully, uh, probably there's a little bit of money coming out of the bank while you're uh, in the recording process, but that's uh, what music's all about. Now, I've, I've got here about uh, Graham. Graham, now, how did you get involved in uh, this music with um, Shirley, uh, Graham, just quickly? Gunpoint. Gunpoint? <laughs> yes. Okay, and it was loaded or...? Oh, you never, you never ask that question. Yeah, well, there you go. That was an interviewer's nightmare that I just uh, put my foot into. So anyway, um, back to um, Shirley. Um, how would you classify the songs that you're recording there, Shirley? I mean, you know, are they are they sort of a pop rock sort of ballad, or are they sort of more easy listening, or what would you what would you define them as? Kiwi pop, I think. Kiwi pop. Gosh, you're putting yourself right up there with uh, well, Nikamara and all the rest of them, aren't you? Really? I mean, yep. it'd be, be nice to. Uh, yeah. Well, anyway, what we'll do, uh, what we'll do now is, um, I just, uh, I see Mike over there. Now, here's the drummer. Now, I'm a, I'm a bit of a drummer myself. I'm not, I'm not, I wouldn't say I was that good, but anyway, Mike, um, so how was it like laying drum, drum tracks down today at, uh, at Shane's? Oh, it was good fun. Yeah. yeah. And, um, and so this is all part of the Shirley project as well? Yeah. Yeah. I sort of got, um, talking with Shirley on Facebook and saw a, a few of her songs and, yeah, and then we got chatting, the and then she decided she wanted to get me on the drums, and I was like, "Oh yeah, okay then." So you were recruited, but not at gunpoint. Not at gunpoint. Oh, that, that was good. So <laughs> I was willing to. Yeah. Well, there we go. Well, enough of. Um, there's been enough shots fired in the studio just uh, in the last five minutes. But tell me about your honours. Uh, how many honours circles? Well, you've you've said about the fourteen hundred and three, uh, and 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 what sort of reception are you getting? Like, are people leaving comments? Yeah, really, really encouraging comments. Well, that's a lot awesome. of good comments, and quite a few likes as well. And 
not just on YouTube, but on Facebook and even on Reboot Nation. That's great. Well, I know that I've been trying to post it onto my wall, um, and I see that everyone's posting it onto each other's wall, which um, it seems to kind of work pretty well, doesn't it? It does. It's good. We've got sort of. Shirley's got fans in Scotland and England and oh, fantastic. Nairobi. Oh, Nairobi. Look at that. <laughs> way out Nairobi way, eh? Now, okay, so so you've got your Facebook page, your fan page, so so they can just look up Shirley Ryder, can they? That's right, yes. Shirley Ryder circles will take them to... So it's um, as easy as that. And, um, and so, like, you know, but you're leading into Christmas, obviously, you've got the EP, but you... You know, you must have some kind of plan on how you're going to promote that leading up to Christmas because there'll be a lot of other artists, I suppose, vying for um, the, the potential dollar. Um, you know, some say we're in a bit of a recession. I mean, hey, you know, I mean, it's great to get something for 99 cents on Reverb Nation, but once it goes into the shop and it's on the stands, how, how, are, we going to, how are you going to stand out? How are you going to pull them in with your Kiwi Pop? And, and I mean that in the, you know. Well, I'll show you the truth. We're probably just going to go... Um Going to go live and do some gigs around the place. Oh, awesome! Place. So, so with the CD. Oh, yeah. fantastic! So is that sort of leading into Christmas? No, or? it won't be. It'll be after Christmas. So it'll be New Year's. So you've got a New Year's Hopefully, gig? Yeah. Oh, not at the moment. No, but where would you like to play? If, if you had the choice, say, say you got a phone call today from all the pubs and they said, "Well, hey, we we want you to play here. Where would you like to play? Where would you like to play, Graham? Not in the pub. <laughs> all right. Maybe well, you can have a stadium, or you can have a stadium. I'll be good. Well, there you go. Well, I'm not too sure if that's, uh, you know. Anyway, so the EP is going to be out. That's going to be great. And so we're looking forward to you playing live. That's going to be great. And the lineup, is that going to be Mike, Graham, yourself? We're still looking at that as well. Um, and we also need to pull in a bass player because at the moment we're just in the process of recording still. Okay. All right. Well, it sounds like it's very exciting. Um, you know, I'm about to play circles for the for the full length, and uh, and I'm anticipating a lot of phone calls coming into the studio today uh, from a lot of people that perhaps haven't heard this kind of music before. Because I I must admit, when I first heard it, I thought, wow, that's a really cool song, and it did have my head going round and round in circles. But it, it had me singing the song as well, and that's what it's all about. It's all about you know um, that catchy melody, and you most certainly seem to have captured that. And I, and I sort of you know I really respect that. I think well wow, for. You know, for someone, so, you, so you're Tauranga, Tauranga based? Yes, yeah. Yeah, I mean, that's awesome, you know, coming out of Tauranga and um, I just, uh, and, and about the video, so where did you shoot that video? Just here at um, Soundtree. Oh, wow. Shane's, Shane shot it with his camera, it took us a couple of hours, eh? just out in the paddock, down by the stream. I had a bit of a challenge walking down <laughs> to the stream, not back and crossing <laughs> over, but... Oh, you didn't fall in though, did you? <laughs> no, thanks to Shane. <laughs> Did it, was he the man of the moment, was he? Did he pull you from uh, the ever... Help me across, backwards and forwards. Ever creeping tide. Well, speaking of ever creeping tide, I, I just wanted to say thank you very much for your time today. Um, oh, it's, it's, you. been a, it's been a real pleasure sitting down here. She's uh, having her coffee, Shirley, and I'm having my V, and uh, I don't know what Graham's having. It could be a cup of tea, but it looks like the boys are all happy. And <laughs> oh, yeah, good old... Cup of tea. there, <laughs> cup of tea, cup of right. tea. Well, anyway, thank you very much, Shirley. Thank you, uh, Shane. Yeah. And uh, always a thank pleasure. You. Thanks, Graham. Graham Hardacre. Thanks, Fantastic stuff. Great work. Excellent thank guitar work. And uh, Mike, we'll look forward to the CP. And uh, we're going to leave you now with Circles. And we will be doing the seventh, seventh night, we'll just get that right, Bloodline later on in the show. So look forward to that.